What's up, YouTubers? It's Harper 89, and the voices in my head coming at you from the Duelist Den. And today's video is actually a response video to Averly 32. Now, Averly 32 uh, was pretty much so essentially ranting about how his channel isn't growing. And one thing that he mentioned in his channel, uh, well, there's actually several things we're going to go over, but one thing, the first thing I want to talk about is he mentioned in that video that. Uh, Whenever somebody posts a uh, negative type comment, he blocks them. Sorry, Amberly, that's not your channel's not going to grow if you're blocking people who give you negative feedback. Okay, it's not going to happen. I mean, I know you've got like you know ten times the amount of subscribers I do, but here's the thing: negative feedback, positive feedback, it doesn't matter. You know, those people are still watching your channel. They're still watching your videos, whether they like them or not. I mean, I've got, I mean, I get hate all the fucking time, but guess what? Those same fucking people are back two days later watching another video and they're giving me hate on that video. I don't fucking care. All right. You want to hate on my videos? That's fine. That's your opinion. I may not agree with your opinion. Other people may not agree with your opinion, but that's your opinion. Okay. Uh, what, what everybody needs to realize is that not everybody is going to be happy with everything. Okay. Uh, it's just, it's not going to happen, man. Now, another thing he mentioned was being separated from the pack, and he said that he th thinks his chain burn it, uh, stuff is what makes it separate from the pack. Um, yeah, chain burn is cool, chain burn is interesting, but it's not really that complicated to figure out, all right? I mean, doing, you know, like nine, ten videos over, you know, how to play chain burn, you know, and different variations of it, it's not really going to be the, you know, the thing, all right? Now, yeah, you may not want to take my advice. I may be a lot smaller than you, you know, 10 times smaller to be more precise. But I do know, you know, like how to keep people captivated, how to keep them coming back. Even the people that hate on my channel, guess what? They keep fucking coming back to hate on it again and again and again. That's fine. I don't give two fucks. All right. I'm a little bit edgier, you know, than most people because I just don't give two shits. All right. You want to hate that? It's fine. You're still coming back and watching my videos. Okay. But anyway, um, yeah, I got lost my train of thought there for a second. But anyway, um, you want to stand out? Yeah, that's great. Small timers? Yeah, we can't. Uh, uh, small timers, you know, we need to find something to stand out. And yeah, it may take you a while. I understand you've been doing this for six years. Okay, I get that. He's been being, you know, he's been on YouTube six years. Uh, he's been a channel for six years. But still, I mean, people are still coming and watching your shit. All right. Uh, People are still, still liking your videos. You're still getting some subscribers. Yeah, you're going to lose some every now and then. That's just the way it is. You know, you can't please everyone. But, you know, another, uh, it's just the way it is. You know, another thing he pointed out uh, was that uh, some big YouTubers don't help the smaller people, even though at once upon a time they were smaller. We got to think, when they were smaller, how do you know they didn't try to go up and get help from the bigger guys? All right. Maybe they got shot down, you know. I mean, who the hell knows? I mean, you just got to keep pushing through. You got to keep trying, you know, and personally trying to run your YouTube channel like a business. I'm not sure how much that will work. I mean, I mean, if you can make it work, that's great. That's fine. Props to you, buddy. Uh, more power to you. But YouTube is an entertainment social media platform. People come on here to be entertained. Okay. Running it like a business now, to some extent, yeah, I can see how it would be good. You know, uh, there's a lot of good business practices that can be applied to YouTube. You know, like uh, marketing, uh, advertising, things like that. A lot of good, you know, a lot of, you know, crossover there. But trying to run it solely like a business, uh, I just don't think that's going to work. And even DZF, uh, you mentioned him in your video, you know, kind of shooting you down saying, fuck no. Uh, yeah, DZF's an asshole. Me and him have been going back and forth on go back and forth on Zodiac every now and then. Uh, and he, you know, he's an asshole, but I think he, what he does is he realizes that you can't just base it, you know, off of just from a fully business standpoint. His stuff is actually entertaining. Some of it is informative. Uh, you know, it's, it's just he knows what he's doing, uh, and he doesn't try to you know go too far into one range or another. And I think maybe that's what you're trying to do. Try to go to uh, a little bit more to the extreme on the business. Maybe you need to back off of the business aspect just a little bit and focus a little bit more on the entertainment aspect. And I think maybe that could help you. 
Uh, now, like I, I said a couple times already, you know, I'm a small, small time YouTuber. You know, I'm you obviously been doing this a hell of a lot longer than I have. I've only been on YouTube for a little over maybe a year and a half. Uh, yeah, a year and a half ish, about right now. But still, I mean, my channel uh, here recently, you know, has been steadily growing. I think in the, like the last two weeks, I've gotten you know. 20 subscribers, 20 subscribers. So now, yeah, this may not seem like a lot, but you know, I am a small timer, you know, 20 subscribers in three weeks. Yeah. I mean, considering that, you know, over the course of a year and a half, I only got up to like 40 and, you know, I doubled my subscriber count just in the last two or three weeks, or I got a uh, one third boost on my subscriber count just in the last couple of weeks. And personally, I just, you know, I come on here, I talk, I be myself, you know, that's all it is. And I think a really one of the things you're trying to do is you're trying too hard. Okay. Uh, yeah, put effort into it, but don't try too hard. All right, uh, this that's just all I can say for you, man. But um, anyway, uh, that that's about enough. Uh, that's enough for my response video to Avery. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, guys, make sure you like that video, subscribe to the channel. Uh, I think I did that backwards again. But anyway, like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave your comments in the section below. And until next time, I just want to say that Yu-Gi-Oh is not just a game. Yu-Gi-Oh is life.